is that the man that that uh, my family, my branch of the family is making of, of General Mills, is that they, as soon as legally possible, uh, stop producing uh, you know, Pillsbury products on occupied territory. And uh, but until they do that, we will continue to boycott and promote this boycott. It's not only on occupied territory, it's a sweatshop that where the Palestinians uh, are searched when they come in, when they go out, uh, they stand, they work under armed guards all day, and they get half the wages that, that Palestinian would if they're working in Israel. So it's a wretched situation. important that all companies in similar sense do the right thing. I mean, if a company as well known as General Mills and, and, and took, would stop making their Pillsbury products, I mean, that would send shockwaves in a statement like that. The U.S. is a, a settler colonial state. So is Israel. Israel is doing exactly to the Palestinians what we as uh, uh, North Americans did to uh, the first Americans, to our indigenous brothers and sisters. This is about Zionism, not about Judaism. Zionism is a political ideology. Judaism is a faith. It's a weaponized term that Zionists use to persuade people that we somehow by supporting Palestinians, we must hate all Jews. I mean, that's just absurd. They are trying to ignore this, hoping it'll go away. Um, you know, because right now, we're just a, a mouse dealing with an elephant, you know, but after a while, even, even elephants have to deal with the mice. I'm not making a financial sacrifice by, by you know, criticizing um, General Mills and, and their you know, use of the factory in the occupied territories. Right? It's really a matter of justice, um, plain and simple.